Hello friends, my name is Ramsu. Today we shall discuss about a topic that what is BIOS or Basic Input Output System. And today's uh, topic is very very interesting especially if you have interest in uh, computer technology and you want to learn about it. So let's uh, start friend. First of all I would request to please subscribe to my YouTube channel and click on the bell option as well so that my new videos can reach to you and also you can follow me on the Facebook page and Instagram as well. Friend BIOS uh, basically stands for Basic Input Output System and is a software stored on a small memory chip in your system motherboard when you boot up your system and look at the screen at the right time you may see a startup message that uses the term bios you may have possibly heard variations of the term bios but for example if you are wondering then what is bios no worries it's the same thing bios is alternatively called rom bios pc bios and system bios BIOS is the first software that runs when you power on your system performing an initial pack of diagnostic test post or power on self test to see if there are any issues with the hardware. Post is the first step in your hardware boost uh, boot sequence. The machine wouldn't continue with the boot sequence if the post fails. So to recap BIOS is a firmware in other words software embedded uh, in a piece of hardware stored on a ROM chip that lets you access and set up your system at its most basic level. A BIOS contains the instructions your computer needs to load its basic hardware including the post mentioned already. If you system a uh, fail the post you will hear a series of beeps different beep sequences indicate various issues. BIOS firmware is a uh, non volatile meaning that the settings are saved and can be recovered even if the machine no longer has power so bios has mainly four fee functions post the post function tests the hardware before loading the operating system bootstrap this function locates a capable operating system if the loader finds that system the bios passes control over to it BIOS driver. These are low level drivers that give your system basic control over its hardware. BIOS setup. This function is a configuration program that lets you configure your system hardware setting. This configuration includes system settings like time, date and password. If you want to upgrade your BIOS chip to add more memory to it, you must completely replace the old BIOS chip with a newer one, more advanced model. You can update the data on your BIOS chip but only if it's a flash BIOS. Older BIOS chips don't have this capability and must be completely replaced. A flash BIOS lets you update the BIOS by booting with a special disk or executing a particular set of instructions. This way you don't even have to open the case. So friend, thank you. Thanks a lot for watching the video. I hope you like this video. If you like it, please share it with your friends and colleagues. And thanks a lot for watching the video.